Walk around, I'm going on feet, focus, uh, focus. All right, so, so 2.5 GTI swap. We have original engine mount from the GTI for the gearbox side, and this side of the engine mount from the Beetle. 2010 Beetle, four steering pump as well from the Beetle. Um, pretty much that's about it. Everything else fit. I can see space kind of tight, but some of them, think, some of these things will move out soon. Like right, this pipe, this pipe will come out. So from the old turbo system, I'll take that out. Um, yeah. And then boosting coming soon again. A first world guitar start up with the stock setup. So next we have the wiring. Do all of the wiring. And it seem as if we can even use what the clutch stock clutch line from the VR6 slash GTI as you see. <coughs> Basically the same thing same clip so either either I'm gonna swap all this put it back on the trans or I'm gonna just take the line and put it on that whichever one work best but that's that axle same axle from the GTI both sides let me see if we can get that too. same axle I just have to bring that side put the double bone mount up but check the space the gap how much lighter this engine is for a lower this as well big gap mm -hmm. pulley clearance you can see pretty close but this is actually a pipe so pay that no mind but that about an inch gap and as you see power steering pump this is from the beetle this is from the beetle so now we can have power steering the original power steering line is here but we also get we also get the one from the junkyard which is pretty long you can always swap this out for the other one from the junkyard but if we really wanted this to work we could because we can bend that out and drop it on but now swap this with the junkyard power steering line which will run right down and go underneath pass and go back over there <clears throat> so we also have that uh, you can see 07k five cylinder so yeah uh, we have that we have the turbo manifold from the other one I plan to run as you see so that coming soon as well we have intake sure intake was I met this intake a while back and so I met this intake a while back so that pretty much so fall in line like that you know? so I have that that's gonna fall in line clearance as well in case you are wondering about the ground clearance should have be plenty of clearance almost in line with the control arms perfectly flat so that shouldn't be an issue well we'll take the last hurrah
Yeah, video. Yeah. Well, I'll skip you some more. That's a bit of a loss, you know? Yeah.